I've heard rumors of abandoned warden camps all over these parts. If we have time, I'd like to take a look. See if there's anything we can salvage. You're oddly charming for a man I found wandering the forest. I always thought myself more odd than charming. But I'll take a compliment from a lady. They're hard to come by these days. Compliments or ladies? <laughs> Both. So, is there something large and heavy you need moved? That would be a waste of your particular talents. Oh, really? You're much better suited to standing in front of dragons while they try to eat you. I have to say, my lady, you're unlike any woman I've ever met. I'm flattered you'd spend any time with me. I enjoy your company. I want to hear more about you. Compared to yours, my life will seem dull indeed. What did you do before you became a warden? I was a soldier, a, a nobody trained to wield a sword and follow orders. I grew weary of fighting other men's wars. So you became a warden? More or less. Becoming a Grey Warden was the first time I felt like I mattered. The life I led before seems hollow in comparison. Perhaps one day it will fade away. Your name, Blackwall, doesn't sound Orlesian. Marcher, then. Ferelden. I was from the Free Marchers originally. Markham. That was a long time ago. Another life. I hear that many Wardens were once criminals. You're right. When you join, your past is forgotten, so let's leave it that way. Why did you join the Wardens? Because they remember honor and sacrifice. Words that have little meaning to the rest of us. Because they lay down their lives for those they have sworn to protect. We all need to believe there are such men in the world. I needed to believe I could be one of them. We can continue this discussion at another time. Very well. I'm here. Let's talk about the Grey Wardens. You must know a lot about them. Ah, the Wardens. I'm afraid we're less exciting than we seem. The Blight's been over for ten years. What do Wardens do when the world's not ending? There are still Darkspawn. Just because we killed so many in Ferelden doesn't mean they're gone. And the world is not so peaceful that there's no use for good men with swords. Sometimes you have to figure out for yourself what the pledge to protect others really means. It's not always about just archdemons and blights. Where were you during the Blight? I was in Ferelden, on my own, like always. Quietly killed my fair share of Darkspawn too. You haven't had contact with other Wardens for a while. Why were you on your own? It's what I've always done. Recruitment only requires one man. Besides, I've always been a loner. Works best for everyone that way. So you have no idea where the rest of the Wardens are? 
We found that odd. The blight is over. We don't need an organized force. And orders don't change much from day to day. <laughs> For the last thousand years or so, it's been just find Darkspawn, kill them, repeat as necessary. Let's continue this at another time. As you wish. I'll be here if you need me. Yes? What do you think of the Inquisition? I expected more. More men. Better equipment. You may have Andraste's favor. But wars are won by men, soldiers. Avoiding war altogether would be ideal. <laughs> True enough. Still, it never hurts to be prepared. One thing I will say about your men. They're passionate. Devoted. You inspire them. Build on that foundation. And you will have an army that makes nations tremble. What do you think of Haven? It's a war camp that was once a pilgrim's refuge. It's the state of the world though, isn't it? Holy ground turned into a battlefield. Pity about that temple. Would have been nice to see it. What do you think of the Inquisition's cause? Restoring order is a goal I support wholeheartedly. But that's not the end of it, is it? Not by a half. The Lady Seeker believes we are restoring the Chantry. Others say it needs reform. I don't know where you stand on the matter, and I'll admit I haven't made up my mind either. What do you think about all this trouble between the Mages and Templars? Looking at it from where we stand, it seems inevitable. But that could be hindsight. How many of us actually saw it coming? Either way, I don't think the Chantry will ever recover. <laughs>